Okay, so here's what this piece looks like on the inside. It's got these kind of uh, springy pieces right here, some little cotton material on it. And that's what moves around in the circle, and that's what the deer are stuck to. Those are the magnets. And they also kind of move up and down and a little bit in and out because they have to move on that um, non flat surface it's got a lot of bumps and grooves and stuff in it like that so that's how they can move around on it without falling off but right there is the problem this thing was brand new in the box and you can see right there that belt has a kink in it and it's just from sitting they just get hard um, people store them outside in sheds or in your garage and the heat and the cold temperature changes and that belt right there is bad so it'll work for a little while but the problem is, is if you watch it when that motor spins that belt is really sloppy on there you can see it how it kind of jumps around and what will happen is it will either eventually break or it'll just start slipping really bad and this piece will not work anymore. You'll have to replace that belt. So we're gonna go ahead and replace that belt right now. And the replacement piece, you can get it from the Department 56 website, is the 1.75 inch drive belt. And you can see right there, it's used for through the woods and it's also used for these other pieces. So the 1.75 inch belt. So, go ahead and get these belts out of here. There's a brand new belt right there. 1.75, nice and round, no kinks in it. Is relatively easy you can just grab the old belt and kind of pull it around this little pulley it comes off and you can see how distorted it is you can even feel the difference in it it's, uh, when you get them off you can feel how dry and brittle they feel so that let's go into the trash and this new belt we will just place right around this wheel like such Kind of hard to do one-handed. Start it from that side. And you can just kind of give it a little spin, and it'll go right around. And one of the things you want to be careful is, is that um, on these wheels, these plastic gears, and sometimes they'll have some, uh, like a lubricant on there to kind of make those spin a little quieter and a little easier try desperately not to get that on that belt because it will just spin um, and it's kind of a pain you basically just have to throw that belt out and get a new belt so now when we turn it on it rolls nice and smooth no crazy sloppiness in it and this piece will last and run for probably a another year or so I would say before that belt has to be changed out but it's really easy to do all right hope you guys enjoyed it